Okay, I'm sitting here with uh, Worf yeah. from Samael. Um, Samael is founded in uh, 1987, I guess. Right. And um, you started as a duo. How does it come? Well, I, actually, you know, we, we, I was playing with my brother, so I didn't know any any other people to play with. So that's how it started. And then, you know, we, we found a bass player and so on and so forth. And we, we had some lineup change throughout the, the years and we got a new lineup for, uh, I think, almost uh, not a year, but like half a year now. And works in, working fine, so yeah. Okay. Sure. Um, yeah, t tell us a little bit about um, the start of Summer Ale until now in a few short sentences. <laughs> Yeah, well, I, I don't know. I mean, you know, we, we got 10 albums out, so we, ha we had like a, a constant evolution somehow. We started up, as you mentioned, as a duo, then, then we were a, a three-piece band and a four-piece band. We had a keyboard in the band, so that was like a first step with Ceremony of Opposite. Uh, in 96, with Passage, we actually uh, started to play with the drum machine. So everything shifts toward a more industrial and uh, electronic sound and kind of mix those together with metal. And um, yeah, then we would try to incorporate other elements, you know, to keep the thing interesting. And I guess, you know, um, since like, I don't know, three albums or we, 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 we kind of try to, to refine it, but we haven't had or changed a, a lot since, since that time. But we try to refine it and find a sound that, you know, fits us the best. Yeah. Uh, you mentioned industrial and you are often described as industrial metal band. Um, what do you think in general about genres in metal? It doesn't bother me. I mean, you know, metal is metal. I mean, that's where I start, you know, uh, my, my first shows are on Maiden. And, you know, they, they were like hero of mine and they're still somehow. Uh, but, you know, I'm not really um, narrow-minded when it comes to music. I mean, I, I can't listen to anything as long as it's good. Uh, what do you think about gothic metal? Well, you know, it was, it was kind of a gender that, that was invented somehow. I, I, I don't know how that came. I mean, we, we've been somehow uh, regarded as member of that scene somehow. And I'm fine with it. I mean, I guess Paradise Lost probably started up with the album Gothic and people kind of make the, the connection, I guess. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I mean, you know, as I say, I, I, I like dark music in general, so you know, it fits somehow. Yeah. What What's the diff uh, the the biggest difference between um, uh, now and then? So the start of the band and and the process and what's the biggest difference until now? Well, it's different to say because it's difficult because uh, we're not starting now, so we we already got got to follow over somehow. Um, I guess, you know, internet have changed a lot of things. Uh, music is not consumed the same way it used to be. Uh, but, you know, vinyl are coming back. You know, it's something we we haven't seen it coming. And I think it's a great thing because, you know, somehow you, you listen to music, but it, it for me, it's always good to have something. I like to have books, for example, uh, to, to be surrounded by things that I like. So, yeah. Uh, you toured a lot um, through all the world. Besides of Japan, but you have a forthcoming tour That's in true. Japan. That's true. We, we're going to go for the first time in Japan in uh, end of uh, October, uh, actually beginning of November. And yeah, we're looking forward to this. I mean, it, you know, it's been a long time we wanted to go there and finally it happened. So yeah, we're happy. Are you excited? We are. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we are. Um, uh, your last album is from 2017, um, Hegemony. Um, what's coming next? What can your fans expect from you? Well, you, you know, I, I guess we, we put a lot in this album and we, we, we're going to try to, to develop more out of it. Uh, we haven't toured yet, we just play festivals. Uh, so we see, you know, we, we see what's coming next year. We, we have a few plans, but nothing is concrete right now. Uh, we're definitely going to do more festivals, but probably going to tour. And uh, that's what we're looking for at the moment, yeah. Uh, you mentioned tour and festivals. Do you prefer playing on festivals or do you prefer playing um, a strict tour and what's better? I, I like both. I like both. I mean, it's a bit different because on festival there's a lot of people who don't know your music. Uh, maybe they're just familiar with the name or, and you know, you, you're, share between, you're, you're split between the people who, who come for you and the people who discover you and this is kind of exciting. Uh, on a club show, I mean, it's more intimate. I mean, you know, you, you know, people they're they're there for you, so it, it's somehow easier, maybe more fun. I don't know. I mean, I like both. I like both. I like a little bit of challenge as well. Yeah. How was it to play the seventy thousand tons of metal? It is fun. I mean, we, we did it three times so far. 
And yeah, I mean, I, I didn't think it will happen the first time I heard about the, the, the concept. I thought, well, it will not work, you know, but it works and it works really good. So yeah, I mean, you know, kudos to, to the guy who organized us. Uh, we know him for a long time and, you know, I'm happy that it's still being strong and, and keep on being what it, what it was supposed to be. Um, I, th I thought, uh, I never was there, um, it's a big difference playing on a ship. I, I, don't, I don't know if it's really different to play, but, but you know, the, the, the thing is you, you're, you're kind of uh, in, a, in a close environment and you see the same people over and over again, you know, on a breakfast in the morning, so, so you get familiar with a lot of people through, throughout the, the, that five days. And uh, yeah, it, it is different because you know I've crossed a few people today at the signing session. I, I know I, I might not gonna see their face on, on the crowd, but there you know you see them like three times in a day. So it's, you're not making friends really, but you're making more, more connections, something stronger. And yeah, it's appreciable. Yeah. What do you think about this festival? I mean, you haven't played yet, but arrived. yeah, it's very nice, very nice. Yeah, it's it's what the. the 15th edition or? 14th. 14th. Okay, yeah. But, you know, 14th? Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. You know, it, it's not like a, it didn't happen yesterday, so it, there, there is some experience and you can tell. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's good. Okay, do you have some last words to the audience? Well, you know, thanks for the support. I mean, that's all we can say, really. You know, we, we, we exist because people still want to hear us, so yeah, thank you. I have to thank you. Thank you very much.